Hello there, in this video I'm going to talk about the new options bar we have in Microsoft Teams meeting. So here I am in a channel in a Microsoft Teams team where I'm going to start a, meet, a meeting. As you know, we can start a meeting just using the Meet Now uh, option. So I'm going to click on here to start a new meeting. Here we go. I can add a, touch, a subject, I can switch off the camera and so on. So in this particular case, let's put just a subject for the, for the meeting and then click on me now. Here we go. And as you can see here, this is the new uh, options bar we have for Microsoft uh, Teams meetings. It's basically a very modern uh, options bar where I have all what I need for a, a, a meeting in Microsoft Teams. So I had the possibility to turn off, uh, turn on the camera. The same with the microphone, so I can mute and mute the micro. Uh, also, I have the option of sharing uh, this, my screen. Obviously, this depends on the uh, Teams client you are using. In this case, since I'm using the web client, I don't have the option to share my desktop. I can only share a specific a, a slide deck or Microsoft whiteboard or free hands by InVision. I have also the option in the three dots to, yeah, here we go again, to show device settings. This is going to show the device settings panel where I can choose uh, what device I'm going to use for my meetings. Uh, I can also, the sorry, I have also the possibility to show the meeting notes, enter full screen mode, the keypad, start recording, and turn off uh, incoming video. Apart from uh, these options that are in the three dots menu, I have also a shortcut to the conversations in the meeting, uh, clicking on this icon, and uh, the same with the participants. And finally, uh, I have the option to hang up the call. And that's all. Uh, I think it's super useful, this new options bar uh, in Teams, in Microsoft Teams. I hope you also have found this video interesting. And talk to you soon. Bye-bye.